As I've said before, you don't have to spend a fortune to buy a beautiful set of kitchen appliances. In this video, you learn the best affordable luxury brands, their best products, and their problems as well. Stay to the end if I know the number one brand for 2023. There's a lot to cover, so let's get started. KitchenAid upgraded their dishwasher line two years ago. They now have four levels of wash action and a cool new third rack. After the dishwasher line's basic. Their popular refrigerators haven't changed in at least 10 years. Their most popular series are single evaporators instead of dual evaporators for better temperature management like the other brands. And their newer dual evaporator refrigerators are incredibly expensive. The stoves are just okay, but do have good capacity. But they haven't changed in a while. KitchenAid is also not Wi-Fi enabled. A few years ago, it may not have been an issue. Now Wi-Fi has some decent functionality, as you will see. KitchenAid is a good name, but the products are unspectacular. Fisher Pickle is an interesting portfolio for appliances like counter dip refrigerators, custom finishes, and dishwasher drawers. They have an interesting new product, including pro style ranges and custom colors. I use the word interesting because you may be looking for a diversion from stainless steel. Cafe has some options, and Fisher Pickle is in that same category with red, white, and black finishes. The products have a certain design edge to them as well, so they look different from your neighbor's kitchen. Their panel ready integrated refrigerators are five to $12,000 less than other built in types. They're also the only company with a double drawer dishwasher, and their availability has been excellent as well. I had to put Samsung on this list after I featured their much publicized bespoke lines product you should not buy. I like Samsung. They were the first company to add design into the appliance. As a result, every brand had to follow. Now everyone's kitchen looks better. The same is true for most of their current products. They're mostly affordable and good looking. The refrigeration is well conceived with tons of models from French doors to double drawers and four door refrigerators. However, some of their products can be over engineered as well. Their double oven ranges cannot reach temperature independently. And I like their family hub refrigerator with the smart tablet built into the door, but really your phone has more functionality. And I do like the color options on this bespoke and I don't want people mad at me again, but the color should be on your stove as the central focal point in your kitchen. Lastly, their customer service, as everyone has commented, can't keep up with the demand. G Profile is decent functional products. The ranges have 21,000 BTU output burners with good capacity. You can buy a French door refrigerator in any number of sizes and styles. And their new dishwasher with special sprays for bottle and silverware may be the best at $9.99 on sale. G Profile is similar to their cafe line, just in basic stainless steel without customizable options of the more upscale products. All G appliances are Wi Fi enabled through their Smart HQ app. We'll talk a bit about smart functionality later in the video. Beko is one of the fastest growing brands around the country. Better appliance availability is part of the reason. Beko is a front control range, a French door refrigerator, a quiet dishwasher and microwave for under $6,000. It also looks good and has excellent first year reliability. They rank highly on availability, innovation and reliability. For instance, their range has surf convection with a larger fan than the others along with slats on the side for better overall airflow and even cooking in all racks. Refrigeration is blue lighting in its drawers to promote photosynthesis and an ethylene filter to keep food fresher longer. Their new corner intense dishwasher is Wi-Fi, an unbelievably quiet 39 decibel rating, and an intense wash to clean even casserole dishes. And Beko is all about sustainability. Their new front load washer tub is made out of recycled plastic bottles. Beko has a limited name recognition and it's a limited product line. Bosch has always been considered one of the best affordable luxury brands. They're part of the BSH Corp, along with Thermador and Gaggenau. Their crystal dry dishwasher uses volcanic elements to absorb moisture and emit heat. It can even dry plastics. The refrigerator is popular as the only freestanding refrigerator with two compressors for more consistent temperatures. They place stainless on the back of the refrigerators because it absorbs cold better. And their Home Connect Wi-Fi system is highly rated. Great dishwasher, fantastic refrigerator. However, they don't have a lot of cooking options and they lack the product selection of other brands. Let's give LG some credit. Nobody has had better availability than LG during the last 18 months, except for maybe Beko. Their products are the most reliable based on 40,000 service calls completed by our service department last year. 
It's also unique with interesting products for refrigeration. You have their see-through InstaView door and slow dissolving craft ice options. The stoves are amongst the largest with a 6.3 cubic foot pure convection, even in gas. All their appliances are Wi-Fi enabled and can be operated remotely through an app on your phone. The best part is these appliances are available and starting at $64.99 for the suite. LG Studio has some interesting products as well, and their SKS line has a unique titanium finish on their appliances. Finding service is a con if your store doesn't have any. I could say the same for most of the others as well, and also LG has no color choices. Had a hard time placing Cafe or LG One or Two. Either way, you should consider Cafe if you don't want another stainless kitchen. Cafe is their most popular alternative, white. Yes, white finishes have returned with different handle finishes like copper, black, and brass. The black finish and copper handle is a nice option as well. Cafe also has a mirrored finish with exceptional gas and induction double oven ranges, including a six burner, 30 inch gas range. The refrigeration includes Keurig coffee as an option, and their whole line is Wi-Fi connectivity as well. Smart HQ is another interesting Wi-Fi app. They added modes like steakhouse and turkey modes, among others. As I said, Smart is getting smarter. LG and G are working on self-diagnosis on the appliances to send a signal of problems before they become issues. Not a ton of options like most, but it's a pretty solid line. You can spend $6,000 to $15,000 for an affordable luxury appliances in several different finishes and features. Before you spend $30,000 on a luxury appliance package, check out these brands for less than half. If you want to learn more about luxury brands and products, click this link and thanks for watching.